firm has been involved in pharmaceutical litigation for over a dozen years and has handled these cases and other birth control medication cases uh, since uh, 2005. We, we uh, worked on another birth control litigation that's very similar to this. We've, we've been in the Yaz, Yasmin litigation since the beginning. Uh, was the first lawyer to get compensation for a Yaz victim in the country. And that was for a, a woman from Chicago who had a pulmonary embolism, and uh, we got her a good settlement. Uh, Yaz birth control actually involves four different products. These products are, are versions of the same thing, yes. They're very, very similar and uh, uh, almost identically similar in terms of their ability uh, to injure and the mechanism of injury um, for the victims. As I said, we've been doing personal injury and uh, specifically pharmaceutical product liability litigation for a dozen years. Uh, the last three years alone, we've recovered over $140 million for our clients and settlements uh, in various pharmaceutical litigations.